Hey, hey, hey. Welcome to your weekly episode. <laughs> oh, man. Um, this week, I was asked about self-love and confidence. This is not something that used to be a strong suit of mine. And I think that it will be a continual area to pay attention to throughout life. Um, loving ourselves, accepting ourselves in a, in a humble way, um, but being confident in, in our personality and our, our giftings, our skill sets, um, our personality. I already said that. <laughs> okay, first, I'd like to focus on the love part of it because I believe that the confidence will come in afterwards or during um, in your journey of self-love. So I would say number one, pinpoint, identify your, like the root things. So um, reflecting on how you view yourself, what what is your perspective of yourself? What are the thoughts that you have of you? Um, for me personally, I have always kind of, uh, ever since I was a kid, I've always thought about how other people view me, how other people think of me. Um, and you know, how could we, how could we, uh, not, uh, think about that, especially you know, maybe in any area, but especially physically in the culture that we've grown up in. Um, I'm a millennial, so I know maybe a chunk of you watching are millennials, Gen Z, or you want to say those labels, but 90s babies, <laughs> even 80s, um, and, and older, like we have that culture of television, media, um, pictures everywhere, you know, Instagram, be, be teachable, be open. Uh, that's where you will grow. You will grasp onto wisdom. If you desire it, you will grasp onto it. Um, if you humble yourself and go, whoa, okay, this is, this is an area that I need to work on or, um, you know, like, wow, this, my eyes have just been open to this, you know, like I didn't realize about this about myself or anyway, pinpoint those things, those like root things that, uh, would say like, those are, what are your main issues? You know, what are your main problems? And I'm sure that you can pinpoint them really quickly. Uh, whether you just want to think about them, write them down, whatever process is good for you. It's like, you know, not everyone needs to know your business and you have the power to choose who you want to tell what to and why. Um, I love that and would encourage you to give that some thought about um, your your life, your privacy. What do you, what does that look like for you? Also, like another thing that I just like want to mention is like as you pinpoint these things and process through them, just let them go. And also forgive yourself, like, man, you know, like, dang, like, I wish that I would have loved myself so much longer ago. You have to love yourself and accept yourself no matter where you are, because otherwise you're going to live in misery. And I don't want to do that anymore. I have done that way too much. Depression, been there hardcore many times. We can talk about it another time. Not so fun, but boy, have I been there. And all the things that I've experienced in life and I've had other people experience too. Gosh, we all have so many stories. Do you know that? And I hope that you can process through your story and begin to share it or you'll you'll share it in the right timing. There's, there's timing. Um, timing and certain people, you know, I believe that parts of our stories will speak to different people at different times. Amen to that. <laughs> um, let's see. Yeah. So let go of things, forgive yourself, start like, man, I read this book called get your hopes up and hope like put on hope every morning, write yourself a note. If you need to like 
Reminder, like hope, exclamation point, positivity, positive thoughts. Like we have to train ourselves to think positively and it takes, it takes some time. And if you're like, man, I don't know how this mindset, my mindset can change because I have thought this way for so long and it's been a part of my lifestyle or part of your everyday life. Well, I was right there and I had the same thoughts and I'm like, man, how can this change? Like it's so intense, it's so deep. This is the way that I've thought for years or for however long. Um, just get, like right now, just like get rid of that and just believe believe that it is changing and take the action steps in order for those things to change in your life and the confidence will follow these things embrace your personality get to know yourself um what do you what do you like you know like change things up get get outside the box like do it do that thing differently walk on that other path you know like just start like opening your eyes, opening your heart, and go for the joy in life. Can I get an amen? <laughs> okay. Well, I think that's plenty enough for now. And I have this little thing, this little remote that can stop the video remotely. So, hope that encourages you. <laughs> Bye.